Hello everyone. So today, we are going to be talking about the Forsaken. And my predictions as to what might happen to them in Battle for Azeroth. My thought is, yeah, something's going to happen to Savannah by the end of Battle for Azeroth. I don't know if that's going to be her dying, or if she sort of just kind of goes away, kind of like either Thrall or like um, Illidan did to like protect something. I, I, I don't know, but I think she's going away in some way, either death or, you know, she just walks away somehow. I, I'm not entirely sure about that. Um, so who might actually succeed her, though, if she does leave or die? Of course, I think the, you know, the first person who might actually succeed her is um, the Thanos. It, it seems like the most logical, you know, choice that Nathanos might be the one to take over after uh, she goes away. Um, I I don't know how strong of a leader he would be for the first second and how they really would you know how they would really react to him being in charge though I think he would be more the same for for them you know he's just as cold and calculating as you know Servanus is so I think he would make the most be the most, you know, yeah, I think he would make the most sense to take Savannah's place as leader of the Forsaken. But I, I also seem to think that from reading um, Before the Storm, in case you haven't read it, some spoilers are about to happen, um, from reading it it makes it's leading me to believe that the alliance might be getting some sort of undead um allied race at some point because in the book uh Kalia Menethil who if, if you don't know or didn't, didn't level a priest um she is sister of Arthas Menethild, thus the rightful heir to, you know, Lordaeron. Um, she dies during. She dies during the um, the uh, what was it? The, the day where they um, allow the Forsaken and human to, you know, see their their counterparts, their friends, their families that they thought were dead. Um, and she dies during that, but they take her to the uh, priest Aura Hall, and the Naru that you save at the beginning of that Aura Hall campaign. They, um, she resurrects her as like a light, light undead, a light forsaken. I, it, it's not entirely clear what this really means, but she is kind of the first, um, light undead. And I think more might be coming or I, I feel like 
there might be a faction of of undead that want to be led by her and I feel like this is an opportunity for them to have for the for the alliance to get a light uh, like a light forge undead uh, I feel like they would be a little bit different than the normal undead while the normal undead or normal forsaken are kind of you know, very corpsey, and you know, limbs are falling off, and some people who don't have jaws and stuff like that. I feel like the light forge ones would be closer to like what Nathanos looks like, where he pretty much still looks like he's alive. Like he looks as he would be if he was alive. He's not rotting or anything. It, you know, he just has the red eyes. You know, he's more looks like Savannah's, you know, she herself is not rotting or anything like that, unlike her Forsaken. And I feel like that's how the Light Forge ones would be, except they'd probably have, like, glowing, you know, yellow eyes <laughs> instead of red. And I think that's how, how they would all be. So there wouldn't be a direct, you know... Forsaken copy and paste, but maybe lighten them up, kind of like the Drain Eye, Light Force Drain Eye were. But I think there would be enough of a difference to justify a Light Forge, you know, undead, Forsaken, whatever. I I, I don't know what what they would be called really, and they would be led by Kelly Manifel, and I think they could probably do something with the ruins of Lordaeron, maybe like a fixed up version of the upper part of Lordaeron. The the um you know, King's Chamber could be like where where they start. Um maybe like the quest to unlock them would be um going into Undercity and like purifying it. Or you just purifying the area around uh, Loran. I, I think I think that could really very well happen. But what do you think? Uh, let me know in the comments below. And until next time, bye.